Hi friends, welcome to the video lectures on Technical C by Shravan Kumar Mantri. Coming to the question number 6, insertion. So, inserting an element in an array in a particular index. First, we will see an example here. Let us suppose this is an array where the elements are given as like this. Totally the size is 6. Now, I want to insert an element. So, where I want to insert first and what is the element? Both are required. Let us suppose I want to enter element 50 at the position. I'll give it as 3. Remember position is 3. That means 1, 2, 3. Third position means the index value is 2. Let us suppose if it is a fourth position, the index is 3. Fifth position, index 4. Fifth, sixth position, index 5. That means nth position means index is n minus 1. Remember this point. Now I want to insert 50 at position 3 means index is 2. So here I want to insert 50. So now what is the resultant? 30, 20, here it is 50. Now after this, this 40 should be moved here. This 60 should be moved here. This 90 should be moved here. Now the array size will increase by 1 where I will insert the last value. Previously the size is n, now the size is n plus 1. Remember these points. So how to do this one? What is the logic? So you might find that, so first I will insert 50 here at a of 2. Let us suppose if I insert 50 here. Now if you want to search for the value 40, where, is, where it is available? So that value is removed, that value is replaced. So this is a problem that we will get when you consider first if you insert. So what is the logic we will do here is, whatever the last element is there, that I will insert in the n plus 1 position. That means this is a n minus 1 position, I will insert it n. So 80 will be moved here, 90 will be moved here, 60 will be moved here, 40 will be moved here. So everything is arranged. Now you can observe whatever the element new new element I want to insert a particular position now I will insert. Now you can observe all the elements are successfully arranged. That means insertion happened and then successfully I have changed the positions of the next elements. So this is the logic I will follow. The first thing is I will move the elements to the right then I will insert the element whichever I want to insert. So this is the logic I will follow. Let us see that logic in terms of program. So anyway first I need to consider the size of an array that is the same thing I have taken array of 100 and I am giving the number of elements that is size then I am taking what are those elements simply this is scanning the elements now asking for where I want to insert the location that means the position so where I want to insert 3 you know so that I want to give here the variable is position ampersand position now the value also to be given no? the 50 so enter the value to be inserted so value also I have given so now in our example the position is 3 value is 50 so now we need to answer position is 3 means index is 2 remember this point now you can observe the logic so first I starts from n minus 1 so n minus 1 means what is n value in our example 6 now 6 minus 1, 5. So you can see from 5 till the position minus 1, till the position value is 3, 3 minus 1, 2. That means till this. So starting from 5 up to 2. You can observe what I am doing here. Array of i plus 1, i value initially 5, 5 plus 1. So array of 6 is equals to array of 5. That means 5. What is there in 5? 80 will be moved to array of 6. You can see here. This is the index 6 now. 5 4 like this so now whatever array of 5 80 will be moved to here array of 6 so 80 came here now next again loop goes i decremented now i value 4 so array of 4 is equals to array of 5 so next array of 4 so 4 plus 1 array of 5 equals to array of 4 so what is there in 4 90 90 will be moved here Similarly, the next value, array of 3 plus 1, 4 is equals to 3. That means 60 will be moved here. Next, 
40 will be moved here now i value is equals to 2 okay so 2 plus 1 array of 3 is equals to array of 2 that is over now i value is equals to 1 when comes to i value is equals to 1 1 is greater than or equals to 2 no then it comes out so when it comes out you can see array of position what is position 3 3 minus 1 2 so array of 2 what is there in array of 2 actually array of 2 is also 40 that has to be replaced now is equals to value so I kept that as 50 so now you can observe so resultant array is you need to print and one more thing you need to observe here I starts from 0 I less than or equals to I have written why means now the array size is increased by 1 that's why I starts from 0 I till equals to the size is 6 in our example that means 0 to 6 means totally 7 elements I have to cover you can observe here starts from 0 till 6 so the index 6 all the elements will be printed so like this we need to find the logic this part is giving the size this part is giving the elements this is entering the position that you want to insert here the value you want to insert here the logic where you want to transfer the elements to the right side till the position and entering the value at the position so finally printing so this is about inserting an element in an array so how to delete an element at a given index we'll see in the next video lecture thank you